If we have a building like this and want to cut it easy and fast, there are a couple of ways to approach this. One is to go with Boolean using a box cutter. We add it to the scene, scale it up to the taste, and maybe switch it to display as wires in the viewport. Then take any piece of your building and drop on it a Boolean modifier with the box cutter as an object. An easy solver for the Boolean is more manageable, and you have got yourself a slicer on this wall. So you just need to select every other piece on the building and copy the modifier from the wall with Control L. We can also approach this with nodes, it's super easy, and we did make a full tutorial on those two types. But the one I need to show you today is a basic tool to do one-click selections or multiple cuts with no time. To use this tool, you just need to select all the objects you need to cut, then switch to edit mode by hitting tab. The one tool we need is the bisect tool. This will be located under the knife tool, and you can see here a small arrow meaning this tab contains more than one option. So hold the left mouse button on it to select the bisect slicer, then make sure everything is highlighted by hitting A. You can now switch to any view front or top, then with one click, you can cut through all of it. You can hold control to make the cut straight, and the cut area is manageable by the arrow, which appears after you're done, or from the pop-up menu similar to many tools. But the options we need are the three checkbox, the fill, and the clear in and out. The clear ones will cut half the shape based on the cut direction. And if you check them both in and out, you will get a fine looking section for your building, which can be adjusted using the number on the menu. You can even make it into a 2D plan by flipping the cut direction to horizontal. And you might notice that the fill sometimes goes crazy, so you need to work the numbers around if you have it on. You can also check those three boxes before you start from the top. So go with A to highlight all, then slice and repeat the process to cut any shape you have easy and fast. I do wish it had an array option for multiple cuts, or if it takes modifiers on it, but that's what we have to work with. Still cool for fast sections. And that's it. Do like and sub if you're still here, and see you next time. Stay sharp. Goodbye.